Hello everyone. In today's video, I'll be discussing a case study based question from the chapter coordinate geometry for class 10. So it goes like this. To conduct sports day activities in your rectangular shaped school ground ABCD, lines are drawn with chalk powder at a distance of 1 meter each. So you can see here, this distance between these two lines is 1 meter. 100 flatboards were have been placed at a distance of 1 meter from each other along AD as shown in the below figure. So 100 flatboards have been kept here along the line AD at a distance of 1 meter. So that also you have to be careful. Sometimes they can give 2 meter, 3 meter. According to that you have to change your answer. Niharika runs 1 fourth the distance AD on the second line okay one fourth of the distance ad on the second line and post a green flag preet run one fifth the distance ad on the eighth line and post a red flag now we'll read the question at what distance niharika posted the green flag from the starting point of second line so she is in the second line. Total distance is 100. They have given 100 flower posts have been kept. So the total distance will be 100. And he, she runs 1 fourth of the distance AD. 1 fourth of the distance AD. Distance AD is 100. So 1 fourth of 100 is 25. So the answer will be 25 meter total distance is 100 meter out of that she runs one fourth next question at what distance preet posted the green flag from the starting point of eighth line so starting point of eighth line she runs one fifth so you have to do one fifth of 100 which is equal to 20 meters now what is the distance between both flags so we need to find out the distance between both flags using distance formula so her distance will be she is on the second line that is why i told you have to keep in your mind the second line 2 and 25 and she has run this is on the eighth line x coordinate will be 8 and y coordinate will be 20 now we need to find the distance between both these flags we know the distance formula is x2 minus x1 the whole square plus y2 minus y1 the whole square x2 minus x1 the whole square is 8 minus 2 the whole square plus y2 is 20 minus 25 the whole square so which is equal to 36 plus 5 square that is 25 so when you add this we have root 61 meter so let's find out whether it is there so root 61 meter is the distance between both the flags now if Reshmi has to post a blue flag exactly halfway between the line segment joining the two flags where should she post her flag so first the first flag that is Niharika's flag a green flag is at the distance 2 and 25 Whereas preet flag that is green flag is at the point it is at the point 8th line no? so 8 20 we need to find midpoint of this because they have asked exactly halfway so 2 plus 8 is 10 10 divided by 2 is 5 again 25 plus 20 is 55 55 divided by 2 is 22.5 so this is the answer here we are using the midpoint formula midpoint formula is x1 plus x2 by 2 and y1 plus y2 by 2 the last question if Sheda has to post a white flag exactly halfway between line segment joining a and red flag where sh should she post her flag so red flag is posted by Preet so let's find out from the graph where is the point a and the red flag is posted by Preet. So here A and this coordinate will be 8, 25. And she want to post exactly at the midpoint. So 
So coordinate of A is 0, 0 and this one is 8, 25. So we need to find the midpoint of this by using midpoint formula x1 plus x2 by 2. Again y1 plus y2 by 2. So which is equal to 0 plus 8 by 2. 4 by 2 is 2 and 25 plus 0 by 2 which is equal to 12.5. 8 by 2 is 4. So it is 4 and 12.5. So answer is there 4 and 12.5. So this is our answer. This question has been asked from the chapter coordinate geometry case study based question. So here we are mainly using the distance formula and the midpoint formula. And the distance formula is square root of x2 minus x1 the whole square plus y2 minus y1 the whole square. And midpoint formula is x1 plus x2 by 2 y1 plus y2 by 2. Thank you for watching my video.